Hi guys, welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm making a cheesy chicken bake. Alright guys, I'm starting out in a saucepan. I have three tablespoons of butter here that I'm melting down. And we're going to make a mushroom sauce for in our cheesy chicken bake. But I'm only going to put it in half because my son Eric doesn't like mushrooms and I have to keep half of it without mushrooms for him. But if your family likes mushrooms, you'll put it all the way through. Now I'm starting with one cup of sliced mushrooms we're going to get in there. And I'm going to throw in one small onion that I diced up fine. Alright guys, I'm going to allow this to saute over medium heat for about five minutes or so until those onions start to turn translucent and the mushrooms soften up. Okay guys, now that my mushrooms and onions sauteed for a few minutes and they're nice and softened up, I have a can of cream of chicken soup. We're going to add that into the mushrooms and onions. And I'm going to add in just under a half a can of milk. So you just want to take your soup can and fill it almost halfway, but not quite. About like that. I'm going to get that down in there. And I'm going to allow this to simmer for a few minutes to get my flavors incorporated amongst each other. Alright, now in a 9x13 baking pan that I spray with some cooking oil, I'm going to start by layering a little bit of my chicken on the bottom. Now normally you would layer your mushroom onion sauce, but since I'm making half this without the mushrooms, I'm going to do it this way for the kids. And what I did is I took two chicken breasts, put a little poultry seasoning on them, put them in a 400 degree oven for 20 minutes, roasted them, and I shredded them up. Okay. Now I have some oven ready lasagna. If you like, you can boil your lasagna, but I use the oven ready stuff. It's a little easier. I'm going to layer that in there. And I'm going to take a piece and break it. If I don't break it all the bits, for up at this end, it'll still taste good, guys. And I'm going to take some of my mushroom sauce, and we're going to put it on our half. Eric's half won't have any. And he's missing out because it's going to make it good and creamy. And guys, this cream of chicken soup really has the chunks of chicken in there. So look at the size of that chunk of chicken in there. Alright. Now I have some ricotta cheese here. I'm going to go ahead and let me grab a spoon quick, guys. Sorry about that. I'm going to put my ricotta cheese on here. Smear it out. And it may have been easier if I put the ricotta cheese down first before I put that mushroom sauce down. But it'll be alright. You just want to smear your ricotta. You could also use cottage cheese for this, guys, but I'm not a big fan of cottage cheese. I think it's more so the texture of it. And then I'll just dollop some of this on this side here for the boys. My son Greg is fussy about mushrooms, too, so I'll probably give him from the side that doesn't have mushrooms. But me and Holly and my son Zach will eat the heck out of this side. All right, now I have some shredded cheddar cheese. I'm gonna put a healthy layer in there. It's looking good. Then I have some shredded Parmesan cheese. I'm gonna put a layer in there. And guys, nice to it, this is called cheesy chicken bake because it is cheesy. Now I'm going to repeat those steps again until I finish my ne next layer and then I'll bring it back. Alright guys, and I'm going to have to remember that our side with the mushrooms is on the left and Eric's side is on the right. See his side's a little lower because it doesn't have that mushroom sauce in there. I'm going to put this in a 350 degree oven uncovered for 45 minutes. After the 45 minutes when it's done, I'll take it out and let it rest for a few minutes and then we'll cut into it. Alright guys, this is done. I left it rest for 10 minutes. Now I'm going to finish it by hitting it with a little bit of parsley. And it's mostly just for color. Very uh, minimal flavor. Let's go ahead and slice up a piece of this and see what we got. Alright guys, let me get in here and give this a try. 
You can see how nice and cheesy that is. See that ricotta cheese coming out? That's really good. Lasagna's tender. It tastes like ricotta cheese and that mushroom sauce. That's killer. Eric doesn't know what he's going to be missing. One more try here. That's really good, guys. It really wasn't that hard to make. All right, there you have it. Cheesy chicken bake. Give it a try. Thanks for watching, and until next time, I'll see you.